Welcome everyone. Um, as you can see, I'm playing around with the waypoints missions here today. Um, I think I'm testing it out for the first time here. This is actually the first time I'm setting up a waypoints mission. Uh, finding it fairly easy. Um, I did find a little few issues um, that I'm not sure if it's a bug or me doing something wrong. Still up for, for debate, but I'll discuss that a little bit later as well. Um, so as you can see here, uh, the video is also a little bit long. I'm going to put some, some chapters in there so you can skip to the parts that you find relevant. Um, so I did three waypoint missions here. Um, this is the first one executing as we're seeing here now. Um, went pretty smoothly, no issues really. Then getting ready for setting up the next one, deleting the two waypoints there, um, and then moving to the next spot for creating the next one. So, as you can see, it's quite cold today. Batteries are not having really issues. So, here I'm going to be setting up the next one. Also, I think this one's going to have three waypoints. See that in a second. One thing I did find is that it adds two waypoints every time that I click it the first time. You see one button, basically. And I think that might also be part of the problem but I'm not 100% sure so we'll wait for this one to quickly move through the other thing I did in this one as well is I manually updated the heading um, using the slider there just to keep it sort of like looking in the same direction don't know if this points into anything as well there we go. And I'm going to execute this one as well. I have to say the usability of this is actually quite cool. Um, you can set up the, the flight path with the gimbal and everything, flying quite close to objects without knowing exactly where they are. Here I'm just cancelling it because I wanted to set the speed a little bit faster. Let's see if that comes through. So once that's ready, um, this one will execute perfectly as well. No issues there. Like here, flying sideways past these trees would be bit nerve-wracking for me still so now I'm looking for going to be looking for a clear button basically to clear all of the waypoints so that I don't have to manually go in and delete them every single time um, what I found was basically that if you exit out of the waypoints flight it would then ask you whether or not you would like to save before exiting and you'll see that I choose the don't save option there as well. Cool. So here I'm going to say exit without saving. Now I'm going to go back into the waypoints and I think that might be part of the problem because I think it created the first waypoint maybe here. If you see roughly where we are now and I'm going to be moving to where I think I would be placing the first waypoint. Here, and now I'm pressing the C1 button again. And you'll see that I have two waypoints, which is a bit weird. And I'm going to delete the second one. And I think that might be the problem, is that it creates it as soon as you go into the waypoints. Thing. So, just setting up where I want to go. Setting up, I think I'm going to be doing four waypoints here. Quickly adjusting the the actions I'm 
then I'm going to be starting it off. I'd like it to go at some speed. And as you can see, we're not at that point where I thought I placed the first waypoint. Um, and now it's going to start heading in a direction which I'm not sure why it's going in that direction. You'll see it now. And this is not the way I thought it was going to be. See it running into a direction, me not knowing why it's going there, stopping it, and then trying to figure out where I'm going. And I did not go in this direction with my waypoints at all. As you can see, I wasn't here before. There's the trees. It's like not really good. And here I'm just going out and choosing to fly this manually. Not going to look as cool, but still look pretty cool. Um, I'd like to find your thoughts, any comments on this as well. Um, see if there's anybody else having the same sort of like behavior, or if you've got a workaround or a way or know what's going on. Thank you very much.